Hi and hello everyone. This video we are going to talk about what is a cyber attack and how to prevent it. A cyber attack is a assault launched by a cyber criminal using one or more computer, again a single or the multiple computer and the network. The attack will not only to destroy the commercial industry but also the government and another private institution. Therefore, that is a very effective to play close attention to the number and trends of the cyber attack. And next, we are going to talk about type of a cyber attack in the Malaysia. First for all, a password crack. A second, a DDoS. A third, SQL injection. Last but not least, ransomware. And next, we are going to talk about how to secure your network. First, keep your software and system fully updated. A second, install your firewall. A third, back up your data. Last but not least, ensure endpoint are protection. Today, I want to ask you, did you know that your password is really safe? If you know, how can you prove it? Here, I want to show you that we can prove, we can see that our password is really safe to use. First of all, you must go to any browser and search estimation time password hack. As you can see, there are many websites that we can use, but we will choose the top one. Before you use any of websites, you must know that websites is really safe to use by checking the lock button besides the website link. Okay, let's go through this website. As you can see, here we can test out our passwords. There are many informations to crack the password, such as a, B, C, D, E, F, G just takes 29 milliseconds. Okay, let's start. I will use A, B, C, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, which is 8 letters for the passwords. As you can see, here only take 2 days and 21 hours and 4 minutes to crack the password. What if I use capital A? It will take 7 months, 1 week and 5 days in year 2015 what if we choose 2020 which is the latest to crack the password it take 4 months ok let's add the symbol at behind it will take 8 centuries 7 decades as you can see this only a b c 1 2 3 4 5 and 1 symbol will take 8 centuries if you use your names or your birthday it will take uh, maybe almost impossible to crack it but if someone know about your information better to avoid it there are several type of password attacks the first one is the brute force attack which is the offline attacks with a password which the hacker will assume most passwords are found in cracking dictionaries. Attacker release on high volume guessing of the passwords, which is password API. It's almost the same with credential stuffing, which is do the attacking online with credentials, which is it also assumes most people use the same credentials on multiple sites attacker will release on breach credentials api for the second one is the dictionary attack where dictionary will guess from the user data password generation and generate the passwords it will show that it will guess the information from the user okay for the third one is the keyloggers okay for the keyloggers the attack will send script injected link to the victim such as an email email scam which is made by the attackers and the victim will click on the link and request the legitimate website and the victim's browser loads legitimate site but also executes malicious script 
message script sends victim private data to the attacker so the attacker will know that all of the data key in on the website such as password, username and emails will known by the attacker. My issue is adopt computer security and data privacy hacking issue. Okay, this hacking date is cyber attack use malicious code to compromise your computer logic or data and still leak or hold your data hostage. As reported in early October of 2013 by security blogger Brian Cripps, Adop originally reported that hacker had stolen nearly 3 million encrypted customer credit card record plus login data for an undetermined number of user accounts. Later that month, Adop raised that estimate to include ID and encrypted password for 38 million active users. An agreement in August 2015 called for Adop pay a $1.1 million in legal fees and undisclosed amount to users to set a claim of violating the customer record act and unfair business practice. In November 2016, the amount paid to customer was reported at $1 million. Okay, for the prevention step for this hacking issue, first one is make sure you keep your software and system fully up to date. Next, install a latest firewall, backup your data always, then controlling your access to your system, always access your management in the online or offline services.